and welcome. My name is Allison Bream and I'm the founder and creator of Virtual Corporate Wellness. In today's video, I just wanted to give you a quick tip in regards to creating a corporate wellness program, but not knowing where to start because of a potential bandwidth issues on the team. So a lot of times what stops companies from moving forward is you know, who's going to be taking responsibility for the corporate wellness program, right? So a lot of times I recommend that committees be established that include representatives of, you know, your, your employees on the front line, managers, executives, as well as human resource individuals. And when it comes time to kind of roll things out or assign work or next steps. It really comes in handy having a committee involved because the burden is not all on one individual. But I highly recommend when you do have a committee to have a point person, that way that they can help manage and make sure everyone's on point and on task to getting things done. Also, a quick tip is maybe have a human resources in intern come on board and that way that they can kind of help things along as well when you know your days are busy recruiting or retaining talent or you know dealing with employee issues so just try this out it might help um, I think this will go a long way and not having the burden all on one person so thanks for tuning in to this really quick tip subscribe to my youtube channel and hop over to my website at virtualcorporatewellness.com Sign in and put your email address and name, um, and I will send you a quick eight-page report that goes over corporate wellness secrets to help elevate your company culture. I know eight pages sounds daunting, but I promise you it's not that bad. So I hope this tip was helpful. Leave your comments below, and I'll see you in the next video.